Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. I am going to do an Aries September Who Is Your Soulmate reading. Um, please keep in mind if this reading resonates with you or if you enjoy this reading, please give me a subscription or a like. Aries, let's find out who is your soulmate. Whomever I'm reading for, who is your soulmate? Who is your September? Who is your soulmate? Let's see, Aries. Who's your soulmate, Aries? For September, who, whomever I'm reading for. <clears throat> Excuse me. Who is your soulmate? Let's see. Show me, spirit guides. Who is Aries' soulmate? Oh, your cards want to fall out, Aries. Who's your soulmate for September? <clears throat> Seven of Cups. Sun. And the Six of Pentacles. Well, I have the Seven of Cups here. And the Seven of Cups um, um, means that there's a lot of different options going on. There's a lot of different people in your, in your space. But there's just one that's bringing to you the sunshine and contentment that you want. Because the sun, which is the best card in the deck. The sun brings you total joy, happiness. Whomever all these other, there's seven of cups is here. This there, There's a lot of different energies around you. But whoever brings you this sun, this joy and contentment, that's who your soulmate is. Not only that, you'll know your soulmate because they're very generous with this six of pentacles there. They're very generous. They're very kind. And the, the thing is with the six of pentacles, it's not one-sided. You don't have to do all these things for them. You guys mesh. You guys uh, uh, mesh very, very well. In other words, you give and you take. There's a give and a take here. Um, they can't give you enough and you can't give them enough. You both enjoy that. It, it makes your heart happy that you guys give like you give. And when I say give, I'm not even talking. I'm not talking about monetarily, although you may be sharing um, some uh, income as well. But I'm talking about you give love to them. They give love to you. They listen to you. You listen to them. Whomever this person is, they're good for you because they bring that contentment to you. They bring that sunshine to you. They make you feel young again. Whomever this, when you're with them, there's nothing but, you know, but sunshine and, and, and goodness. This is what is, like I said, you got a lot of options with the seven of cups. But this one person, this is how you'll know it's your soulmate. They may not be here right now, Aries, but whomever this is. They're on the horizon. There's some. There's someone that brings you, makes you feel young again, gives you joy, gives you contentment, uh, illuminates your good parts, and they're very, very giving and kind and generous in their thoughts and their love to you. So let's see. Let's clarify just to see what the spirit guys want to tell us. What the spirit guys want to tell us. Why is the seven of cups here for my Aries spirit guys? Why is the seven of cups here for Aries? Let's see. Spirit guys, show me why the seven of cups is here. Who's Aries soulmate? Why is the Seven of Cups here? Show me, Spirit Guides. Oh, look at that. This is someone you know. Yeah, no, this person is around you now. Six of Cups, this is someone you have been with in the past. Someone that you have had good memories with. Someone that you have kicked with. Oh, yeah, this is someone that's around you now. If they're not around you now, you know them. You already know this person, Aries. Seven of Cups, you've got all these options. And it's surely telling you with this Six of Cups... All these options really don't matter because it's someone that you know and you've been with and loved in the past. Or they're around you right now. So you need to think. Think. Let's see the sun. Why is the sun card here? Show me spirit guides. Why is the sun card here? Oh, can be a Leo person too because I have the strength card. And maybe in the past, the sun card, I think in the past you guys may have been young. Or younger, it may not be, been, you know, one of you may have been not ready to settle down yet. But the strength card here over the sun card means that you guys are both put all the pieces together and on the same page now. You're on the same page. This is your soulmate. And let's see why the Six of Pentacles is here. Show me, Spirit Guides. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? 
for my Aries. Show me spirit guides. Oh my Aries, look at this. King of Wands, this is someone you're going to marry. This is someone you're going to marry. They're kind, generous, good to you. Someone that you already know. Someone that you guys are now on the same page. Maybe the timing just it wasn't right before. But right now, you're on the same page. And all these options that you have, it really doesn't matter. Because this person is who you want. So let's see, what do my angel oracles have to say? Show me, spirit guides. What do my angel oracles have to say for my Aries? Let's see. What do they say to you, Aries? Let's see what my spirit guys have to say. Oh, wow. They say friendship and union. And I strongly believe this. You are their friend. This is your friend. And I will say that. Um, it's best to marry a friend. Someone that you can be friends with. Because if they're your friend... That know that means they know you, you know them. You're not afraid to talk to them. So friendship and union. So you are going to get together with someone that you know that and I see marriage here. I see marriage here. This is your soulmate. This is your soulmate. That's what I have for who's your soulmate for September. Whomever I'm reading for, Aries. <laughs> 